guys, I'm Lenny. Hey, toy just fell over. I'm Lenny, this is Candle Door Creations, a place for you to come and share all my random crafty bits, bobs, lives, whatever. I am coming to you as always from Cornwall in the UK, where I live with my partner and three tiny humans, one of which has a birthday tomorrow. The tiniest of my tiny humans is only four. Slightly scary. So, it is the 2nd of December, so we are on Vlogmas Day 2. And what have I to show you? Well, I have to show you the ridiculous thing on my head right now. I actually think it's quite cute. And my Grinch jumper. Um, so I made a thing. I made a hat. I love her hat hair. This hat basically stands up by itself. So, and it jingles. I don't know if I'm going to regret putting this on. This was part of a Christmas decoration. And there was like three of these giant jingly balls. I don't know if I've got... I do. I actually have some as Christmas decorations. But the Christmas decorations do the really cute, like, that. Does that. Yeah. This sound I prefer. So I don't know what I'm going to do. I might see if I can crack open, crack into it and like remove the pee that's inside it. No, that would be completely insane. So, a hat and design. It's just you know, a basic elf hat. So the sound does drive me insane. Um, stripes. This actually is striped to match the sweater that I was wearing yesterday. The sleeves have this patterning on. But I actually really like it. Other than the bell, which I'm not too sure about. Um, I do, I tend to work all my hats top down. So I started off magic loop, maybe 10 stitches. And then just done that for a while. Then just started increasing every third stitch, but every other round. Does that make sense? No, every fourth stitch, every other round until it was wide enough and then I just stopped and then done a couple rows of just just in around just no increase and just stand just going around and then I finished with I don't know how well you're gonna be able to see it front post back post off on those as usual and then I went back in at the end and decided that I wanted the little spiky things so those are just it's almost like a shell but with like two points at the top and when the hat was finished i did go around and i have tacked those in place because they're a bit droopy and no one wants a droopy pointy thing so this is my hat this i am going to be wearing for craft fairs and probably just in general the tiny humans two of the tiny humans have asked these as well with the giant ball thing on it um it looks so cute just the noise i'm wondering if i can um i think i could be able to get my glue gun like right into the nozzle and just like glue gun the little thing inside it still so then it's like a purely decorative non-jingling well but there's that one I'm not putting it back on because it is rather hot. And I have given him to put it on my heating. So the heating is still on. So it's hot. Right, the next thing is I'm just making another granny square blanket. For a lady I know. I thought it was rather cute. It's just, you know, basic granny square. With just DK. It's a cream. It was, I think it was from B and M, so it's a couple of pounds. But it seems it's a very chunky DK. I know DK can vary 
wildly. This is a thicker one, which is really nice. And it is, it's a baby, I think it's a baby yarn. I've got rid of the ball band because that's what I do. So it's just going to be this and it's just going to be cream. And then I might put a grey edging and the lady that asked for it wants a little grey cloud on it. So I can do that. Oh, the elf hat. Right. All these yarns are just from my stash. So I have no idea what any of them are. But they're just DK held double, so that's chunkier. So that I've done this in like two hours. I've done this in like two hours. Because it is chunky. And I keep hitting myself in the head with the giant bell. But I do like it. Just the noise in my ear. It's not I'm not kidding. So the next thing I'm going to do with you, and then we are going to go, is my advent calendar. Because I've got a chair. Oh, if I can get it out. Ah, it's stuck in my basket. I bought a basket. I love that basket. I actually take this out shopping with me. I do get a lot of Red Riding Hood comments. So, where is number two? Number two, number two. Where are you? There it is. Right. So it's this one down here. What's it going to be? Do you know I really loved one from yesterday? Oh, I still can't see what it is. Can I put it out without... Oh, who is that? <gasps> Hercules! Now, Hercules is one of those films. Oh, camera's on this side. Hercules is one of those films. I don't, there we go. I, I like Hades. <laughs> Hades just makes that film for me. So it's one of the films where I like the bad guy. Actually, there's a lot of Disney films where I like the bad guy. But, this one. I do like Hercules. I've not seen that. In, I've not watched this in ages. The boys have it on DVD. So that might be on the planning for tomorrow. So that is it for today. Tomorrow we have Merrick's birthday. It's going to be four. My baby's going to be four. That's a bit scary. Um, He's got preschool and they're going to go and watch a school, a private school doing their nativity and the school comes and picks them all up in a little bus and takes them off to watch nativity and then brings them back. So he's really excited that he gets to go on a bus tomorrow. So, is that all I've got to tell you? I think that is all I've got to tell you. I'm getting out of baking a cake because he wants a Paw Patrol cake. And I'm not making a Paw Patrol cake. nothing else for me to say. I am tired and teasy because tiny humans wake up too early and I don't sleep well. But yeah. We are decorating more and more. The tiny humans decided to put up balloons which is a bit weird. Do you want to see the balloons? Right. Yeah. So <laughs> for some random reason we have balloons. And my Halloween wreath because that's up all year round. But that's it for me. I will be speaking to you tomorrow. Bye guys.